yeah. World Championship so far. On his right, we see Thomas Bohomski from the Czech Republic. We see Jacob Anderson from the United States. From China, Xin Bao Feng, and from Croatia, it's Marco Dolic. Uh, a bit of struggling with Jensen Mallorca starting best, followed by Jacob Anderson and Thomas Bohomsky. They had a little struggle, but it's Mallorca making the top speed. Now Bohomsky passed the skater from the United States, and it's Mallorca and Bohomsky first and second, and we have uh, 23.5 first time in this competition and as we heard in the women's category Michael Pascarella from the United States Ariane Paul Guman and from El Salvador Marvin Rodriguez Gomez we know Lucio Marsili is one of the fastest starter of all the sprinters. Yeah, Let's see how it's working on this road. Like it's Lucio Marsili in the first corner. He's leading this race and he is pretty fast. Followed by Chinese Taipei's Yang Li Yangko. And we have Lucia Marsili, also at 23.5. And I saw Li Yang Kuo and Aryan Guman from India on second and third place. In this category, and in the third heat, we will see Indra Medard from Belgium, Su Sheng Chao from Chinese Taipei. Sebastian Predes Tigreros from Venezuela, Danush Babu from India, and Milad Zalehi from Iran. Let's have a look on the first corner. We see from Venezuela Sebastian Predes Tigreros. And we see the drone pictures behind the skaters. And it's Venezuela and Belgium fastest in this heat. Wow. So we have a 24 4. And it's Indra Medard was the fastest time in this heat. He's not quite a sprint specialist. But a fast time with 24-4. Venezuela, Jose Carlos Rojas Rangel from Japan, Hiroki Totori, and from Iran, Mohamed Soros Mer. Off they are, and I think it's El D'Souza, and we we'll look on this drone picture, no, it's a skater from Iran, now passed by El D'Souza, along the straight, and he's in front, but the skater from Iran is following El D'Souza, so we have a 20.0 for El D'Souza, and the second place for Mohammed Soroshmir from Iran. So, and now we are ready for the, the Federation five. from Iran, they have pretty good sprinters. 
from Korea, and heat number five from France, Hugo Morin from Korea, Wong Yu Choi from Argentina, Argentina, Francesca Reyes Petrelli from Japan, Katsuki Kato from. They have to correct. Believe me, we're in the men's category. And we have all the skaters of the fifth heat at the starting line. Maybe Hugo Marin is the strongest sprinter in there, but we see Argentina and Korea in front. Now Hugo Marin on the inside, and Korea is in front. Now second position for Hugo Morin, now first position. Korea is on the outside. And we have a big hawk finish, and we see uh, 24.8, not the fastest time for Hugo Morin from France, winning this fifth heat. And we are ready for heat number six uh, with the Joan Guzman uh, representing Spain and representing Switzerland, Oliver Crow. The elimination final, and he got close to the best set skaters I think and from South Africa we see Neo Mlambo and it's a great effort to skate the long distance and the sprint distances so fingers crossed for Chase Morpe but we have Chevy Guzman in front followed by Argentinians now who are shelling and now it's Oliver Grove from Switzerland on second position but it's Chevy Guzman with the fastest time and we have a 23 dot four of a second faster than Mallorca so and this is the fastest time so far so I guess also Oliver Grove has it has his chance to go to the quarterfinals Guzman so far with the fastest time from Spain Germany Bulquango Ecuador Robert Cook Australia Yassin Hassab from Egypt and Italo Cook from Egypt, Yassin Katab, and from Peru, we will see Italo Science Salazar. The fastest sprinter in this heat might be the full start, Lop and Ulquango. Number 26, first and fourth stunt, 2 6. Yellow card to the Australian skater. Now, off they are, another full start. have a look oh, oh, oh I think again it was Australia so and if I'm right this is not good for Robert Cook second full start. start means you will get the red card so he would be disqualified for this race skating back to the area of call knowing he is disqualified by the second full start so left on the starting line we have Nilop Jeremy Ulquango Yasin Katap and Italo Sainz Salazar Fourth box is left free. And 
Jokka of the R. No false art anymore. Neil and we see Nilov together with Ushuango in front. And they have to go fast, they know. They have to go very, very fast to get to the quarterfinals. And it is Nilov with 23.6, also very fast. Ushuango being Number four, 7, 7 of attempts, second behind Nilo. One skater from Malaysia on our list, but he won't start. So with four, no. It's another skater missing. Uh, it's the Great skater from Pakistan. Skater from Ecuador in the second spot. So it's Colombia first Colombia, second Ecuador. Ecuador. We see Guatemala in the third place and Australia in the, the fourth place. Third. It's Salomon Caballo. Colombian making the speed, followed by Ricardo Vintimilla. And it's Caballo with a 24.2. This is not too fast for Caballo. I thought him skating faster this heat. Very fast guy from Uganda, Serumaga Himran, and from Hong Kong. Tommy Hui. Senior ladies, please go to the call. We have junior six ladies, skaters at the line. The now we haven't with five, so I see the skater from Uganda missing. Fault start. Number 262, first of all, system 26. It's the skater from Hong Kong who moved first. <laughs> it's Tommy Hui. Now, yellow card for the first fall start. And back again full concentration for the start. Now the start it. We have got Tuscan Holgan in front, the Colombian skater, followed by Farberson Bonilla Castillo. From Guatemala and from the Portuguese Antonio Freitas. Going fast for the qualification. John Tascon Holgren realized uh, 23.7. Let's see the speed of the skaters from the drone view. They're amazing fast. Marlon Oramuno Arroyo and from Hong Kong, Ka Shun Choi. In the middle you see the old master, the Reese Verdugo. left you see Edgar Garcia and on his right from Costa Rica Brazil's in front surprising and Mexico taking on the inside also coming on the inside is Riz Rodrigo now skating to the outside getting a better position for the passes on the last corner 
So now it's Brazil or it's Chile? It's Brazil, I think. Oh, Brazil, surprising fast. Let's have a look on the result. It's not confirmed so far. And it's Romildo, Jorge, Silva, Neto, I think. Moving the wheel first across the finish line. Yes, it's Brazil for sure, but we don't have a time. Second is Ricardo Verdugo, but we still have got no time. We can't imagine how fast this heat number 10 was. So looking forward to the heat number 11 from Mexico with Carlos Monsivais Villalobos with Emanuele Silva Santibanes from Chile, from Brazil, Romildo Roche Silva Neto from Costa Rica, Byron Siles from Cameroon, maybe, yes, we see Marcel Didier Jr. Ambu Assam, and we should see from the Republic of Dominica one skater, but I miss him. So let's see who's in front. Skater from the Dominican Republic, uh, Estevez Ortega. Estevez Ortega, Villa Lopez. It's Estevez Ortega from the Republic of Dominica. Oh, how fast he is. So we see. Chile, Mexico, and the Republic of Dominica. We have no results at the moment. Okay, very close. Chile took the lead and took the victory. But we do not have a time of heat number 10 and 11. So, no Slovakia, we see. Jakub Tembara and Daniel Simko, also from Cameroon, Basil Ngwa, on from Canada, Irie Richards, the Ukraine, you see. Kuklic, the both Germans are in champion, front. Uh, Simon Albrecht is a former world, world champion, Albrecht, also uh, World Albrecht, Games uh, winner, uh, so uh, he's an old master also. Uh, followed uh, by uh, Ron Kuklic, uh, that both uh, are uh, trying uh, to get uh, as fast uh, as possible uh, through this uh, course race. And we have Albrecht with uh, 23.5. Impressive fast also, Kuklic is. So, very good, fast lap in the heat of the two German skaters. Category. We will change the category and we will swap to the long distance races. We will see the 15k elimination semi-finals of the junior category. First junior woman followed by junior man. And we have a little, little break during the warm-up session of the junior ladies category. So stay tuned for the long distance semi-finals coming up soon.
a jump start by E. Terry Goodman. A bronze medal only around the current 100 meters. Keep an eye on uh, Guzman's time. Guzman, basically, Cinco, and this is two. Here we go. Uh, Neil Yocto. Amen. Yeah. 